welcome to Magpie Moonchild. My name is Kaylee. This is a pre-order that I ordered directly from Liminal Eleven um, for the Cosmic Slumber Tarot. Um, when this box arrived, this is going to sound negative, but it's really, really not. Um, the box was actually open. The parcel box was actually open and done, even though it had been taped up. The delivery driver was more concerned than I was about it. But um, I emailed, the, I messaged them right away on Instagram, and they got back to me as soon as they could possible same day within a couple an hour i think it was um i sent them the photos and they were quite happy i sent them told them asked them what was supposed to be in the box they told me and everything that was supposed to be in the box was so from a customer service point of view liminal 11 are second to none and they didn't make me feel silly for asking um and they made sure that I was happy with everything and even said that they would be reviewing their postal, the way they pa packaged the boxes because that had happened and checking that the way they secure them at the moment is the best way they can do it. So I thought that was absolutely brilliant. Um, so I got these stickers. I don't know if there was supposed to be one or two, but I've got two and that's not a bad thing. Uh, Liminal 11 stickers. If you, um, I'll put the link down below for Liminal 11. There are so many good decks and books Um. And there are so many, yeah, there are so many things on Liminal 11. You need to go and have a look because they quietly kind of get on with all these amazing things. Not overly quiet, obviously. I did find them on Instagram, but they just kind of just do their thing. And it's really, really good. It's amazing that what they do. Um, so I will go through what I got with the deck and then go through the actual deck. So I got a catalogue from Liminal 11. They are the ones that did uh, produce um, the Modern Witch Tarot which is very popular. Um, there you go, Modern Witch Tarot by Lisa Stell. They did that. Um, and then obviously there's some pictures of the artwork in there. So they have these 365 daily reminders. This is a book, I think. Yep, it's a book. And then obviously it's got little reminders every day to look after yourself. And then the Essential Vegan Toolkit, which is a again a book. Folk Magic and Healing, which is on my wish list. Um, do Yoga Anywhere cards. Um, and then obviously Mini Meditation Series. Um, Lunar Soul, they did Lunar Soul Tarot, which was the first deck from Liminal 11 that I got. Um, Women, Patterns and Plants is another book. Um, and they also have White Newman coming out. Um, this, well, the pre-order's out. I think it comes out January or December or January. But, um... The pre-orders are out now. It also came with the free, because I ordered it from Liminal 11, you don't get this when you order it through Amazon. Um, you get, I got the Cosmic Slumber Tarot bag with it, tarot bag, which is this lovely velvety velour bag with like a waterproof line. It's quite a thick bag, actually. It's lovely quality. It's got like a poly lining inside, but it's lovely quality really thick and plush and it will keep your cards safe in there sometimes you get a tarot bag and it's quite thin but I think this would actually protect your deck quite well obviously it comes from Liminal 11 it's beautiful I'm a seamstress so this is well made it's a well made little tarot um, bag it's not little it's quite big I could probably fit it with the box in there but <laughs> um, it's beautiful beautiful bag um, so onto the deck itself by Tilly Walden, obviously is the artist. Um, <coughs> Cosmic Slumber. I don't know if you... The Modern Witch opens from the bottom. <coughs> Sorry, I've just got... I've got a weird throat today. Um, so yeah, hang on, I'll just get the plastic off. So the Modern Witch opens from the bottom and you slide it off like that. This deck is kind of different and as soon as I saw it I went, thank God I've already pre-ordered that because... It's one of the coolest ways I've ever seen you get into a box. So with the Modern Witch, um, you, you slide it apart. So the bottom comes out straight away. As you can see, the bottom doesn't come out on this one. It does open from the bottom. Um, but it doesn't come out because it's got a magnetic closure between the outside, this bit and the bottom. Magnetite, magnet. So you can sh I can literally shake it. And they're not coming out. So that's really cool. Um, so we have the front of the boxes there. This is the side, Cosmic Slumber Tarot. The other side, 
Oh, it's a little bit bumped, but that's not the end of the world. Cosmic Slumber Tarot. If the universe were to sleep, where would her dreams lead? I love that. It has a booklet with it, and it's a 78-card deck. The two wands, which are on Light at the Crossroads, Liminal 11. I will put all their details down below. But just follow them on Instagram. Even their Instagram feed is so uplifting and light and beautiful and full of gorgeous artwork. So... We have Liminal 11 on the bottom. This inner part comes out. And even the inside of the box look, is all printed with those images and icons. Beautiful. And oh, listen, that echoes it. Oh, that is so cool. I love me a uh, magnetic box. Um, so the deck itself comes, obviously it's wrapped in those things. I will get to that in a moment. You have the booklet that comes with it. There's also, yeah, they said it was stuck. It is glued in, that cardboard. That's a shame. Um, but it's to keep the deck tight. So, but people did say that that was the case, that this is, and you can see, I just bend it like that. It is actually glued into the box. So I can't remove that. In that sense, that is a shame that that's a brown piece of corrugated cardboard when maybe it could have been uh, purple to match, lilac to match. But So even the inside, outside, the outside of the inside is also got this design on it. Cosmic Slumber Tarot. And the inside is printed. But as I said, it's got this corrugated cardboard, which is functional. It's not a bad thing that it's because it protects the deck look so that the deck is in there safely. It's the right width for the deck because the book is wider, goes in separate. But yeah, it's um, it's just a shame that it's uh, not ugly. It doesn't go. It doesn't match. It's not aesthetically pleasing to have a corrugated bit of brown cardboard in there as a buffer. Right, let's go through the instructional booklet. So we have the Cosmic Slumber instructional booklet. Has that gorgeous icons, image, like pattern. Uh, liminal 11 and then you have contents page what a contents page look at that it's a great day today and look how gorgeous that is even on a gray day uh, a foreword from tilly herself and then an introduction and then the major arcana so it explains the major arcana and then it goes into the major arcana you have a color image of the card and then a description down below that is beautiful and it's this gorgeous thick paper. Oh, it just feels amazing. So yeah, it goes through the major arcana. And then I'm going to get to the end of that. So then it goes into the minor arcana. So it has the torches and it has a description word for each of them. So it explains torches, which is ones in the traditional tarot deck. It even says in the traditional tarot deck. Cups, swords and pentacles. Um... Following the court cards, this so they had a look. Uh, these run from the ace of ten in each suit with certain similarities appearing in each number. Aces often suggest of the start of something new, for example. Following this are the court cards princess, prince, queen, and king. So there you go. So it goes through the torches with a description for each one, and then cups. So each of those and then swords. So there's no image of each card individually, but there is a description for each one. Pentacles. And then how to read tar how to read the tarot. And then some tarot spreads. So there's a daily draw, a four card spread, the Celtic cross, dream path of the spheres. Love that. Of what does the universe dream? And then bonus cards, the morning and the night. And obviously that explains their, their meanings there. And then the inside is printed. And then you've got the cosmic tarot icon in the back. I'm just going to slot that back into its place in the box. I kind of like that it has that cushion to keep everything where it's supposed to be. I just wish it was more aesthetically pleasing. So far, that's the only negative I've got of the deck, though. So I took the plastic sleeve off. Um... Okay, let's go through the imagery first. So we have the Fool, the Magus, the High Priestess, the Empress, beautiful, the Emperor. Oh, he's protecting the Lamb. I love that. The Hierophant, 
the lovers, the chariot, strength, the hermit, the wheel of fortune, justice, the hanged one, death, temperance, the devil, the tower, the star, the moon, the sun, judgment, the universe, I'm going to go into the ace of torches, the two, three, four, I love that that's a rest and reclining one, I love that, five of torches, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, the princess, the prince, the queen with her cat, amazing, and the king of torches, the ace of cups, the two, the three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, princess, prince, queen and the king, ace of swords, two of swords, three of swords, the four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, princess, the prince, the queen, and the king of swords. Then we are on to the ace of pentacles, the two of pentacles, the three, the four, the five, the six, the seven, eight, nine, ten of pentacles, the princess, the prince, the queen, the king, and then we go into these two bonus cards, the morning and the night. Beautiful, beautiful deck. Uh, traditional tarot size, normal tarot size. Um, it's the same as the modern witch tarot size, I would say. Um, same style of card. So they're glossy, but they're not that fingerprint sticking to them glossy. Um, beautiful. I love the colour palette of this. It's like earthy pastels. Um, they're gorgeous. Beautiful. Stunning, stunning, stunning. That's the back. That is not what I expected the back to look like. And I'm kind of surprised and in awe at the same time that that is the back of this card, this deck. It's so um, opposite to the aesthetic of the box, like this calm lilac. And I know the lilac is the border, but it's got this fiery, earthy, warmth and en energy to it. It's beautiful. Like a sunset. It's a sunset. I suppose that's where the moon and the sun meet, isn't it? Dawn and sunset. So, But it's beautiful. The sun goes to sleep at sunset. She goes into her cosmic slumber at sunset, so it makes sense. It's beautiful, stunning. Oh, I'm so lucky to have this. So lucky. Uh, shuffle, it shuffles brilliantly. I wouldn't expect anything else from a Liminal 11 deck. Absolutely beautiful. It's. Oh. You need this deck if you don't have it already. I mean, you can get it through Amazon, but please go through Lemon or Eleven if you can, because oh, they've got such a good energy, and they are just all round amazing people. Oh, they just oh, beautiful. The deck that no, it's just just shuffling. It just feels like home. It's like very much like the modern witch. It's a calmer energy to the modern witch. The modern witch is like sassy and funky. This is like karma reflection at the end of the day. It's beautiful. Those purples are just, oh, it is like 
sunset earthy pastels. It's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful card. Oh, stunning. I can't wait. White Newman is also on my list um, to pre-order. When I get paid at the end of this month, White Newman is in. And I might even stretch to the special edition because, um, yes, I might. I was going to do with this one and I was like, oh, I don't know. And now I'm regretting it because the deck is stunning and it deserves for me to have bought the uh, special edition. So I'm kicking myself. Um, but yeah. There you go. That is the Cosmic Slumber Tarot. There's the bag that comes with it. So you can see the size of the bag. It's beautiful. It's like this deep turquoise. It's stunning. So yeah, I, as I said, I will put all the details for Liminal 11 and that on the bottom um, down below. Um, so yeah, I hope that's showing you everything you want to know about this deck. It is beautiful. Please buy it. It's, it's stunning. And just, just for the quirky box alone, like... The only negative I can find with this box is that that's it. And you can't even really see it because the box is shut most of the time. So there you go. Beautiful. Um, so yeah, that's that's that. And um, I'm going to disappear now. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you again soon. Bye for now.